The Daybrook Compressor Station is, uh, is in the uh, northern central part of West Virginia. Uh, we started uh, acquiring land a little over four years ago. And as today, we're almost into our second year of actually uh, transporting natural gas from the producers uh, to the main trunk lines and to the marketplace. When we buy our packages for, for the marketplace, uh, we look at a couple things. We look at uh, the availability and time frames on getting, the, getting it to us. We looked at the longevity. We looked at the availability of uh, actually reliability on what units would be the best situation for us to put into a facility where we can give the best reliability to our, to our customers. In this application, I think uh, Ariel and Caterpillar have, have done a really good job of, of joining the two machines and making one really sound, complete package. We've had real good luck with the Ariel compressors. Uh, there's support teams we have servicing the units. Uh, really knowledgeable and, I, and I'm saying that in respect to uh, there's a lot of them out there and a lot of them still being used and a lot of new ones uh, being built to go into the marketplace. Uh, we do use genuine aerial parts here. Um, we've used a few aftermarket parts in different applications and I just don't see the longevity there so uh, I prefer to use uh, OEM parts. Uh, I think the biggest thing the, the reason I would choose Ariel over, over another uh, compressor is uh, because of their technical support. If you need to have support, they're always available. We've had uh, in the past at a different facility, we had a machine, that um, an old T-frame that we were failing a crankshaft on and couldn't figure out why. And Ariel came in, they sent their whole tech support team out to site. Um, they took the machine all apart. They took a lot of measurements. Uh, they were very valuable in the troubleshooting. Uh, they came up with a fix for the problem and, and we were able to get the machine back together and, and online.